Welcome to Ponderings of the Priest. It is Thursday, December 21st. We are four days away from Christmas. And I'd like to reflect upon lessons learned from Cindy Lou Who. Uh, most of us remember the Grinch, how the Grinch stole Christmas. If we're not still watching it, we watched it as children. I watched it as a child. And I remember watching how terrible that Grinch was and his poor little dog who got dragged into things and how the Grinch used him and and somehow miraculously didn't hurt him. And as he's doing all these terrible things because he hates people who are so happy, um, he encounters little Cindy Lou Who in the midst of his theft of all of their Christmas presents and goods and everything else. And her sweetness and her kindness and her innocence completely take him off guard, doesn't stop him from doing what he's doing. And as he gleefully wrings his hands Christmas morning, it is Cindy Lou Who, who leads all of the Who's in Whoville to a joyous singing around a tree that has no more ornaments in their joy and in their hope of what Christmas really means. And it is in that moment that her expression of her hope and her singing and her joy and her proclamation of the good news of Christmas Day changes the Grinch. And his heart grew was it three sizes or four sizes that day? So in the midst of last minute gift runs and frenzied grocery shopping and figuring out where Aunt Tilly's gonna sleep in the house, remember the lessons from Cindy Lou Who. Remember, remember, the slums of Rio right now. Remember the people in Aleppo right now. Remember those in poor areas of Detroit, West Virginia, New York, all around the world in this country who have little or nothing, but they will still know in their hearts what the hope of Christmas is all about. So let go of your worries, let go of your stress. Remember that Christmas is not about any of the stuff. It's not about anything else than the good news, the joyous, incredible, life-changing good news of the birth of Jesus Christ. Have a blessed Christmas, and we'll ponder some more next week.